This video tutorial will guide you in creating company signages. For this particular project, we will create a signage which automatically attaches to wall or any surfaces. First, open a new family template. Look for generic model faced base. Double click to open it. Now, let's insert the logo image which you would like to model. Go to the Insert tab, and then click the Image button. A browser will appear, look for the image file. Position your logo image in the surface area. If necessary, scale it to meet your required dimensions. Now we can start modeling the signage. In the Create tab, click the Extrusion button. In the Draw tool, let us start tracing the logo. Use the necessary Draw command to complete the logo image. Let us close first the editing of the extrusion, and check the appearance of your logo. Adjust the thickness value as per your preferences. Adjust the materials. Create new one. Modify the properties. And rename it. Now let's us continue the modification. Repeat the same process only. This will take a bit of time. So I fast forward the process. The modeling are roughly made to save time. To model this accurately, it is better to create and guide or reference lines first. It is worth sharing also that it is better to trace your image logo in the AutoCAD first, and then import it into the Revit. In that way, we can just use the pick line tool to trace it. We are almost done. Let us now create the 4 circular logo. In this case it is better to use the solid sweep tool.
adjust the materials, create new one, modify the properties, and rename it. After completing one, let us just copy the other three circular logo. Now save the family, and then click the, load into the project. Choose the Revit main project file which you would like to place your wall signage or logo. It will automatically open the main project file again. Choose the wall surface which you would like to place the signage. Adjust the position. And you're done. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Please like, share and subscribe. Hope to see you in my next video.